Hello all, my name is Abhishek and welcome to my channel Technical Abhishek. Friends, uh, today I am again getting one error while I am running my project that name is JSP Servlet Hibernate MySQL crude example that is uh, based on the Servlet and Hibernate and uh, JSP uh, project where I am using that edit deletion and add a employee project so here what is the error error is that java x dot servlet dot servlet exception throw an example let's see that what is the actual error let's come in the console and let's see that what is the error so here the error is java dot lang dot class not found exception why because of java x dot xml dot bind dot jx b exception file is missing so why the error is occurs because of this in this eclipse project i am using the java which version is 11.0.8 version but this project is only compatible with java 8 or 9 or 10 under 10 only version is compatible so for that this error is occurs so what i have to do i have to add this this jax.xml.bind dot bind jacks b exception chair file under my lib folder so this is my lib folder here i have to add the jar file which is jacks.xml.bind.jacksb exception let's first search this jar file on so this is the jar file you have to download this jar file that is jacksb api jar file and after the downloading you have to add this jar file under this lib folder so already i have downloaded it so here is my jax b api 1.0.1 1.0 uh, so i have to just copy it just copy it and then come under this project lib folder and then just paste it so now here jaxp api 1.0 jar file is already added now let's run it again this project and see what is the output first you have to terminate this console and now cut this console and then just close it and then first you just clean the project and now let's run it this again this project and see that what is whether it's error has resolved or is it again it's happened so I'm just running that Tomcat version 8.5 server at localhost next click the next and then select the JSP server at hibernate mysql and finish that now let's see that whether it's again happened the error or not now let's see this, this running and let's hibernate is running or not just check it So now the hibernate is running here and then table is also created. I think the project is running now successfully. Yeah, now create that user is created. Now let's my project is running. Now let's just check it that whether it's all running or not. Just add new user and just I'm using my name Abhishek Kumar and here I'm entering my mail ID abhishek1996 at gmail.com and I am from India so I am entering India and then save it now let's wow great now it's automatically is created a select and the internet table now let's edit it and check it either whether it's running or just click UK and then save it yeah fine that's UK is also running now let's check it delete option now again I'm adding another that is Shish Kumar and ABC some Gmail ID is there gmail.com and now I'm entering that country as a Nepal and save it wow see here already it's inserted automatically it's inserted inserted because I am using that hibernate it's no need to enter again and again no need to write query again and again it's automatically take the query now it's uh, just check it the delete option whether it's delete or not now just click it yeah it's deleted also see here it's delete from user id where user id have which i selected now it's running successful so thanks for watching my youtube channel friends and if you have any query regarding eclipse and java and j2aa regarding so please 
mention it in my comment i will try to make a video on that topic thanks for watching my youtube channel and if you like please like the button or subscribe my youtube channel thank you